Hey guys, what's going on? Tmart here, and I'm bringing you guys a little bit different of a video today. It's going to be a short little review of this little guy here, the Roxio Game Capture. And uh, it's a new capture card that uh, some good friends at Machinima sent over to me to uh, to check out, try it out, and let you guys know what I thought. And, uh, you know, I'm pretty excited about this because I get messages all the time saying, Hey T, I really want to get into commentating. I just don't have $180 to spend on a Hot Pog HD PVR. What can I I do can I buy a dazzle can I buy an easy cap and all these other different things and up until this point there has not been a device that even compares to the HD PVR or is even worth the money but this thing here is pretty cool that's why I wanted to show it to you guys so let's go ahead and get started with the review Alright, so uh, when we take this baby out of the box, it's super simple. There's like four things in there. Number one is the capture card. There you have it, and it's right next to a pair of scissors. As you can see, it's very small. And then you've also got your component cables. And then also you have your installation disc and a short little instruction pamphlet. And uh, once you get it installed, this is what you see on the start of the program. There's two simple things. You can either capture or you can edit. When you go to capture, as you can see here, there's just a big green capture button. You press that to record. Press it again to stop it and then down on the bottom there you're going to be able to see all of your recordings that you've taken and then if you go over to edit it's just a very simple editing software that allows you to put clips together and then you can edit them you can add audio over them and make your commentaries but enough of the boring stuff let's take a look at the video quality and bam there you go here's some black ops gameplay for you and as you can see it looks pretty good but it's definitely not as good as a PVR I wouldn't lie to you guys if you have 180 bucks to spend I would go with the hop hog HD PVR but if you just want to try commentating out you don't want to spend a lot of money yet then this Roxio device is still a good way to go and you can actually make it look a little bit better snap there we go that's just some simple color corrections there so it looks pretty good and uh, let's zoom this baby out and we can see that yes the PVR does look better but like I said if you don't want to spend too much money this Roxio device is still a good way to go so right now let's take a look at some of the pros and cons so uh, what are some good things about this device well number one is the price it's really really good so for normal people it's a hundred bucks but let me let you in on a secret we can get this thing for 70 bucks because we all love Machinima and because we're a part of Team T-Mart. So if you would be interested in that Machinima discount, the link for that is down in the description. Check it out if you wish. Now, another good thing is the size. This thing is very, very small. It's about a fifth of the size of the HD PVR. So if you don't have a lot of room around your gaming setup, then this would work for you. And then finally, the quality is a good thing and a bad thing at the same time. I mean, it's 460p and that's better than most of the beginner capture cards out there. So you've got the Dazzle, you've got the Easy Cap, you've got all those kinds of things. This thing looks a lot better than those do. So if you're looking for a beginner card, you want to go with this. Now, saying that, that's also a con because it's not as good as the HD PVR 720p. So the HD PVR does look better, but it costs a lot more. So if you're a beginner, you just want to try out commentating, you want to see how you do, see if you like it, I would definitely go with this Roxio Game Cap. I highly recommend it. I wish this thing was around when I started commentating so I didn't have to save up and pay 180 bucks for a PVR. So hope you all enjoyed the review. I really put a lot of work into it and uh, let me know if you would like to see more of these in the future. If you want to check out one of the two videos on screen, feel free to do so and I will catch you all later. There's going to be a great Black Ops 101 episode tomorrow. See you later guys. Thank you for watching. Peace.